One of the first questions that come up during a gas technician training course is what is a BTU anyways? It is probably the most frequently used measuring unit in this course and it is the abbreviation of the British Thermal Unit. Although it is called British but it is Imperial Unit, not metric. The purpose of this video is to explain the calculation of temperature rise when a given amount of heat energy is applied to a given amount of water. Let's start by the definition. The amount of heat energy required to raise the temperature of one pound of water one degree Fahrenheit. For the purpose of this video, we will assume that this heat process is always going to be carried out during one full hour. Here is one BTU and let's assume that each flame will burn for exactly one hour and will give out exactly one BTU. This is one pound of water. Uh, before starting the process it is at 50 degrees Fahrenheit and this clock indicates the duration of the process always one full hour. By definition, the process will raise the temperature of water 1 degree Fahrenheit. The mathematical expression of the process is BTU per hour equals to pounds of water multiplied by delta T. Delta T is the amount of temperature difference before and after the process. In this example, 1 BTU per hour is equal to one pound of water multiplied by delta T, which is one degree Fahrenheit. Uh, please note that this is a theoretical experiment and it must assume that all the heat is transferred from the flame to the water without any loss. Using a second example, we double the amount of heat and double the amount of water. The duration is always one hour. Given that the initial temperature of water is 50 degrees Fahrenheit, how many degrees will it increase? Substituting the numbers in the formula, 2 BTUs per hour are equal to 2 pounds of water multiplied by delta T. Working the math will prove that delta T is equal to 1 degree Fahrenheit, which means the water temperature will increase from 50 degrees Fahrenheit to 51 degrees Fahrenheit. Let's have a look at the third example here. One BTU is applied to two pounds of water this time, initially at 50 degrees Fahrenheit. The duration is one hour. How many degrees will the water temperature increase? Substitute the numbers in the formula. One BTU per hour is equal to two pounds of water multiplied by delta T. Delta T is equal to one over two or half a degree Fahrenheit. And the water temperature will increase from 50 to 50 and a half degrees Fahrenheit. One more time, let's double the amount of heat and the amount of water. Here is two BTUs uh, that are applied to four pounds of water. Initially, the water temperature is at 50 degrees Fahrenheit. During one hour, how many degrees will the water temperature increase? Substitute the numbers in the formula. Two BTUs per hour equal to four pounds of water multiplied by delta T. Uh, dividing both sides of the formula by four, delta T is equal to two over four or half a degree Fahrenheit and the water temperature will increase from 50 to 50 and a half degrees Fahrenheit. As a last example, we have four BTUs applied to two pounds of water. Initially, water temperature is at 50 degrees Fahrenheit and the duration is one hour. How many degrees will the water temperature increase? Substituting the numbers again, four BTUs per hour are equal to two pounds of water multiplied by delta T. Divide both sides of the formula by two and the delta T will be two degrees Fahrenheit. That is uh, going from 50 to 52 degrees Fahrenheit. I hope this was useful.